730. New, stunning new news from uh, NASA. The agency confirming a large piece of debris found by divers in the Atlantic. It's not what they were looking for either. Instead, it's from the Space Shuttle Challenger disaster. WCNC Charlotte's Tom Costello has those details. We got it. The video is haunting. Look at these rivets. Divers from the History Channel looking for World War II plane wreckage off the Florida coast instead came across something they never expected. So what do you think this is, Jim? A 20-foot piece of an American tragedy. Definitely an aircraft. I think we need to talk to NASA. The heat tiles gave divers their first clue. This was debris from the belly or the wing of a space shuttle. You've discovered Challenger. Challenger, go and throttle up. Challenger was lost in a horrific explosion on a cold day in January 1986. In a national address, President Reagan honored the seven astronauts, including teacher Krista McAuliffe, who died. And slipped the surly bonds of Earth to touch the face of God. Today, the crew is buried at Arlington National Cemetery. NASA says the families have been told of this new find. The discovery of this piece was mixed emotions. First, we reflected back to 1986 and the loss of our colleagues, our friends, and our heroes. Mike Barnett was the lead diver. It's very rare when you dive down and find something such as, such as this, and we were blown away uh, when we realized what it was. Uh, this was the last thing we expected to find. The Challenger disaster was followed by the loss of Columbia in 2003. Under U.S. law, any space shuttle artifact must be returned to NASA. Now it must decide whether to recover this lost piece of Challenger. I can assure you NASA will put the memory and legacy of the crew and the families foremost in its thoughts and planning as we move forward. Reclaiming an iconic piece of American history. Tom Costello, NBC News, Washington.